Enter Madness. Oh shit. What the hell is going on? He's having a seizure. Oh, 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 oh. Dr. Fuller, huh? What the hell is happening to him? I can't get up. Don't move, Pierce. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. You're fucking dead, though. What did you do to me? Undo these straps. Whoa, go easy, my friend. You were dead. He killed you. Are you sure he's better? He was he was dead. Me too. We we were dead. What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. What? No. Whoever recorded those voice lines must have had a lot of fun. What happened to me? Where am I? Apparently in an, an, an insane assault. Okay. It did seem weird that, that they would just allow you... If I go out, he'll see me. No! No! You're leaving this cell. Please. I don't want him to find me. Who? I don't want to go to sleep. What? What? Okay, so I can't open the thing? Is sleep the only thing I can do or something? There's gotta be something else I can do, right? Like crawl under the bed, find a secret crawl space, crawl out, Wind Waker style? I guess not. Alright, fuck it. Sleep it is. Oh. The hell? What's going on? Yeah, I thought so. My FPS is not dropping. That's part of the game. What the fu- Wasn't that a door j Okay, no, I'm just retarded. Can't see shit. Alright, whatever. Hi there. That's fucking creepy. Oh dear lord. What are you shushing me for? I'm not fucking saying anything. Hey, it's these lamps. I knew they had something to do with Cthulhu. Is that me? No, wait, that's... Are these all people from pre- in... From... Previously in the story? Hi there. Why are you dying? 
Why are you all shushing me? Go fuck yourselves, I'll be as loud as I want. If my mother can't shut me up, how the, how the fuck can you expect to shut me up? How the fuck are, how how are your dreams being scattered by wind anyway? How does that happen? How are dreams scattered by wind? I don't think that's possible. Huh. <laughs> Choose what? Huh? I will not be here to bear witness to it. Because you will have released me. Leviathan, huh? But the earth will resound to your cries. Or theirs. Oh, shit. What? You there. Wake up. Come on, stand up. We don't what? have much time. Who are you? Are you another insane person? Can you stand up? Well, I mean, I'm fucking standing Bradley right now. Hilton Bradley. It was he who told me that you had been interned here. Wait. Bradley is really alive. I don't understand. You filled me so full of drugs I can't distinguish dream from reality. Please believe that I have nothing to do with these disgraceful treatments. Look, I don't have time to explain everything. I'm not really supposed to be here. And the same goes for you, according to Ethan. You must leave as soon as possible, and as unobtrusively as possible. I've brought you your clothes. Let me go ahead. We'll meet upstairs. Okay. Wait a minute. I saw the nurses at work on a patient. It wouldn't be good for me to get caught. You must avoid them at all costs. If someone found Makes out sense. that I released you from your room, I'd never find work in a hospital. Again. What the fuck? Why are your you to worry about me? Okay, while well, your hands are clipping through your boobs. Mr. Pierce. We must not stay here. There are two men standing guard near the stairs. It's the only way to the floor above. I shall try to distract them and get at least one to come with me. All you need to do is to follow me as soon as the way is free. Understood. Cool. Can I release all of the patients? That would be a good cover for me to escape. Why did everyone suddenly shut up? Why am I crouching? If I don't get out of here, I'll end up like him. Well, I can't release the patients. Poor wretch. Oh, wait, I can see them through. I'm sad that I can't just release all the patients, that'd be hilarious. will be your ruin. I don't understand. These people need care. You keep them in this terrible place as if... Go back upstairs where your patients are waiting for you to treat them. As for you, no one enters or leaves. Yes, Doctor. Alright, so I'm gonna have to deal with those goat fuckers. 
of getting rid of those two myself. The machine hmm. is working again, but the control wheels haven't been put back on. I was just going to the storage room. I can bring them to you. No, Dr. Fuller doesn't want it touching the pressure valve. Good God. There's Why blood everywhere. Machine be used for? Medical record of Francis Sanders. According to his record, the patient seems to be suffering from psychosis. Psychosis. He gouges an old eyes out in an attack of delirium. Okay, then. God damn, that's... That's really something. This is madness. Are they seriously thinking of transmitting the worse and worse? Damn it. The liquid connects it to the electric current. What are its properties? Um... Have I activated anything? This machine seems to consume a great deal of electricity. Seems what will so. happen if I increase the current to the limit? What will happen indeed? I can still increase the load. Oh, I see. Okay then. I I understand. What? Oh, cool. Okay then. So I start the machine, I get into the closet, and then I jump out and punch the dude in the back of the head. Or, alternatively, I hit him in the neck with a hacky sack. Is there a connection between this corpse and the machine? Hmm. The corpse is complete. Whose are these limbs? Interesting. What the hell? Oh, that, that was the closet that I just got into. I have a suspicion that someone's going to be in here. My suspicion was incorrect. Zoology, esotericism, mineralogy, and a full shelf on cephalopods. Cephalopods? Dementia, self-inflicted hmm. wounds. Irene Sanders, wife of Francis Sanders. Huh. Anatomy, anthropology, nothing surprising. Sarah Hawkins. She was a patient uh, uh. here. Interesting. Zoology, esotericism, mineralogy, and a full okay. shelf on cephalopods. So, is there anything else? Anatomy, anthropology, nothing surprising. Mm. So, my guess is that. Charles Hawkins was messing around with the, with the, uh, you know, the cult, messing around with Cthulhu. And Sarah... ...didn't want it anymore. So, Charles had her in the, admitted to that. To the asylum. So that he could continue unimpeded. OH! SHIT! Shit. Ah, what the fuck? How are you? For fuck's sake. Fine, just grab me. That was loud.